Uh, today, we will be challenging Sean to eat something strange and weird that he hasn't had before. Strange and weird. I'm up for the challenge. So let's see what we can find. Here we go. Ladies first. Clear, doors closed. So, hey guys, so today me and Christina are taking the train from Claremont to downtown LA. So we're gonna check out Chinatown and Little Tokyo. Cool. I wanna tell you guys something. People ask about Christina. Like, who is Christina? Is she your girlfriend or something? Christina's actually been my friend for a long time. Um, we used to have a group of friends who used to hang out all the time and uh, they all decided to ditch us, pretty much. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, not really ditch us, but they, they, they got busy, yeah. They got things they're doing, some of them are getting married, some of them are doing other stuff. So, so Christina's really the only one that hangs out with me and <laughs> goes places with me, so. So that's why, so you guys know. So with Christina being my friend, I wanted to make today's topic about friendships. But you see, Christina and I, didn't always have the good friendship that we have now. It took us both humbling ourselves with clear communication and being transparent. And because of that, we were able to have a real friendship. So I want you guys watching this to understand that when you have friends, it's not always great. It's not always perfect. So if you want a valuable friendship, remember to humble yourself, communicate clearly, and be willing to step out in boldness to your friends. And so much though, that you're even willing to lose that friend to save their life. The Bible says, I know no greater love than that of which one is willing to lay their life down for a friend. And with those things, if you have a good friend, that relationship will blossom and become a great friendship. All right? So thanks guys. Check us out. I'm on the train and I already met some really awesome new friends. So they wanted to say hi. Say hi guys. Hi. Hi. <laughs> so we are at Union Station. Looking for the train to Little Tokyo. Christina is our guide and I am your entertainment. That's it. Sorry you're not too entertained. Say hi, you're on camera. Hi. So Christina doesn't know this. Christina doesn't know this, but I'm gonna offer her a challenge. So what we're gonna do right here is we're each gonna pick something in this store that the other one has to eat. And that's the challenge for today. You ready? Okay. Let's go find something for Christina. That doesn't look like a banana at all. Christina loves little characters, so maybe she'll eat this. I don't know what it is. Pretty much, I don't know what anything in here is. I don't know how to read it, but I'll pretty much try anything, so I don't think she's gonna get me. In fact, I think we should cha challenge her in a better way. Let's challenge her with some financial gain. Christina, 
I would like to up the ante, so we're gonna bet five dollars. Why? On if I don't eat it, you. So I'm you, looking for something gross. Yes. Oh no. If I don't eat it, then I owe you five bucks. Okay. Oh, Deal. No. And then same vice versa. So. Oh no. Let's go. <laughs> Okay, what are we gonna get Christina to eat? Ooh, look at this. <laughs> Feeling devious. It's a little fish. I don't think she could eat it raw though. So maybe maybe we can't do that. That's too bad, that would be pretty funny. I don't know if you can eat it raw. <laughs> What or what can we find to give her? What or what? I guess think about this. Looks like bacon, so it might not be that bad. But it's in a dry, maybe it's dried bacon? I don't know. Ooh, wait, hold on. What is this? Look at that. It's like a little boat full of stuff. I'm trying to figure out what this is. You guys help me? Uh, it's fish. With fish? sesame around it, yeah. So it's, you can eat it right now out of the package. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so here we are, ready to give Christina what I got for her to eat. Do you want to go first? Do you want to eat first, or do you want me to eat first? No, it's good. So you guys saw what it was? Let's give it to Christina. I can't tell you what it is. I know what it is. This is what she's eating. This is what we're doing. This right here. Oh, okay. It's like kind of good in a weird yeah. way. You know it's fish. Yeah, I know it's fish. Yeah. Sure, I knew it's fish. I got you two different things because I cooked this eye. Oh, really? I'm going to try this one first. So that's what it actually looks like right there. I don't know if it looks tantalizing to you, but it's interesting. It's like a chip. Not a chip. Not a chip. Oh, no. Oh, I'm not. Just kidding. It's actually pretty good. <laughs> How's it going now? I like the first thing actually better, surprisingly. <laughs> so, so I'm gonna try this now. There's two of them in there, so you're gonna try one too. Yeah, oh, it feels. Oh, it's, a, oh, it's like half. So, this is the green tea. Look at this thing. This is kind of cool looking. Oh, it opens! Holy cow, it opens up. <laughs> That's what's inside. Pretty crazy. This is actually really cool looking. Flip upside down. Um, and this feels edible. So <laughs> it should be. I hope it is. I'm gonna, it. <laughs> I'm gonna bring us in half and give Christina half. Is it breaking up? Yep. Try it out. That's actually excellent. My favorite so far. That was really good. <laughs> This is so much better than what I got. High five! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I saw a guy eating one. It's like rice in its triangle shape. <laughs> that is pretty cool. <laughs> oh, you gotta, that's how you eat it. You wrap yeah. it in that and eat it. Oh, this is cool, dude. Uh, by the way, great job, Japan. All this stuff is pretty awesome. Does it have instructions? I'm being serious. Like, it does, except like, I don't know what it says. Good. It just tastes like rice. Mm. What's that? It's like little seaweed flavors. Oh. Got a little bit of that on here. Oh, you want me to try it? Okay, now with. I feel like my bites are too big. I feel like I'm eating all your food. That's really good seasoning. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Really good seasoning. Five ten minutes old. 
All right, we gotta move up. They're gonna do a show right now here, Mario Lure City. Hey friends, so if you really like this video, please help me out by liking, subscribing, and sharing. Alright, it really helps me out. Thanks. We're late, and our train's about to take off. We're going to take out Chinatown. We're going to take out the... the, the we're going to check out China. Everybody's looking at me right now. <laughs> the next station okay, stop is Pomona North. Okay, let's try that again. All station stops are brief. As soon as this guy's down. North. Is uh, our next stop. All right, guy, come on, I'm trying to talk. Oh, Anyway, sorry, it's a Marmara. Our next station stop is Pomona North. If this is your destination, please. So, with that said. All right, be Pomona North. Please use the handrail. These guys are so rude. <laughs> Can't even make a video. Okay, I just want to see who's laughing at me. All right, Pomona North. Please use the handrail. Watch steps. You make your way to the train to the exit. Thank you for choosing, actually. So. <laughs> So hey guys, thanks for watching today. Um, video's over. Bye. <laughs>